Hello, today we have a story called Moon Game about a little bear playing a game with the moon. One day, Little Bird showed Bear a new game, hide and seek. First, he told Bear to hide and counted to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then he went looking for Bear. I found you, chirped Little Bird, when he found Bear hiding behind some bushes. Now it's your turn to find me. All day long until the sun went down, Bear and Little Bird played their new game. That night, when Bear was all alone, he looked up into the sky and he said to the moon, let's play hide and seek. First, I'll hide and you find me. Then Bear ran as fast as he could until he came to an old hollow tree. Climbing inside, he ducked down so the moon couldn't see him. Bear waited for a while. Then he poked his head up. When he did, the moon was right there looking down at him. Okay, said Bear, you found me. Now it's your turn to hide. Closing his eyes, Bear began to count just as Little Bird had showed him. One, two, three. At that moment, a gentle breeze slowly hid the moon behind a big cloud. When Bear finished counting, he set out to find the moon. First, he thought he found the moon hiding behind some rocks. Oh, but it was just a flower. Then he thought he found the moon hiding in someone's house. Is that the moon? No, it was just a wheel of cheese. When Bear thought he found the moon hiding in a tree, he shook the tree and cried, I found you, moon. But Bear was mistaken. All he found was a big balloon. Then Little Bird came by to visit. Will you help me find the moon? Asked Bear. Sure, I'll help, chirped Little Bird. Bear and Little Bird looked and looked, but they could not find the moon. So they went to the forest to ask for help. I think the moon is lost, explained Bear. Can you help me find him? Don't worry, we'll help you, replied the animals in the forest. Together, they searched and searched, but they couldn't find the moon. At last, Bear sat down and sighed. <sighs> The moon is lost and it's all my fault. Then Bear got an idea. He jumped up and cried, okay moon, I give up, you win. Just then the breeze began to blow again and the moon came out of its hiding place. Look, chirped Little Bird. The moon wasn't lost. He was just hiding behind that big cloud. Bear was so happy. He danced and danced. Then everyone played hide and seek. <laughs> and that's the end. Have you ever played a game with the moon? Maybe you could try playing hide and seek with the moon tonight. <laughs> we'll see you next story time.